Hello, this is Craig. Let's talk Unity and Shadows. I bought Unity Pro because I wanted to play around with Shadows. I've been really disappointed. This is the only part of Unity that I've been disappointed by. So, just in case you can't see it on YouTube, there are these awful moir patterns striped across the surface of this block. There's nothing causing them. Um, there's nothing up there. These, 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 these awful moir shadows are just artifacts of a bad shadow casting algorithm. Now, yeah, I could bake that in if I never wanted to move the sun again, but uh, it still comes down to the problem that I want her to be able to cast shadows. So here you can see she's casting shadows just fine, and I want her to be able to walk into the shadows and get get into the darkness there, and that's, that working, that's working fine too, but take a look at her hair. That's awful. Look at that. That's unbearably horrific. It's, it's like every quad is being calculated to be stippled with a different nasty, stupid uh, moir pattern. Why would you ever do it like that? Now this is the highest possible settings. I've got it set to very high resolution, close fit, four cascades. Um, this is as high as the shadows can possibly be set to. Now, if I were to change it so that uh, there's a soft shadows, it only looks better because it's harder to see. I didn't want the soft shadows. I wanted hard shadows because I wanted a tune, a tune shadow system where it was like a flat shaded tune with shadows getting cast on them. But you can't do that. Um, now, you can make it so that the hair doesn't actually receive shadows. So, for example, we can go ahead and turn off receive shadows, and now you see the hair still casts shadows on her body, that works fine, and it still casts shadows on the ground, and everything seems to work, oh no wait, it glows in the dark, because it's no longer set to receive shadows. So, there doesn't appear to be any way to fix this, this is just the way it is. Um, if there's any way to fix it, I'm not aware of it. Uh, I looked online at several kinds of tutorials, no one else seems to be complaining, and I think it's because no one else fucking owns Unity Pro. And her body is um, using a standard diffuse. If I if I change it over to tune, look at how ugly that is. And it's actually just as ugly on diffuse tune, or sorry, it's just as ugly on diffuse as it is on tune. It's just that the diffuse shadows has a couple of, of uh, areas that, that have shading across them due to the normals and, uh, and that softens the blow of the horrible shadows being cast. This character is 100% smooth. Um, there is no... Uh, there, there are no uh, creases on this character. So why are there creases on this character? Why are there creases in the hair? The hair is 100% smooth. And if you don't believe that, I can show you by simply turning off the light. Um, oh, sorry, I don't want to turn off the light, I want to turn off the shadow. So here it is with no shadows, right? And I can go ahead and turn on diffuse shading, which will bring the normals back into it. And look how smooth they are. The character is 100% smooth. But unfortunately, the character doesn't have any shadows being cast on their face from their hair, it doesn't have any shadows being cast on their shoulder from their head. Um, it's just not as nice. And of course there's no shadows being cast from the walls. So in short, I've been very disappointed by the shadows. There's no way to make them work right. They're just awful. Um, tremendous disappointment. If someone knows of how to fix that problem, uh, I'd be happy to hear it. Uh, I'm, I'd be very happy to be happy with Unity again.